Hello guys, this is the second part for the Point Pili video and I have to add a new, new and a few things to the video. Uh, apparently this park is really big. We had just a few hours to explore it and a few hours is not enough. There's so many things to see and so many things to do well, I didn't mention in the video because we didn't see it. We run short of time. Uh, for example, is a campground over there. If you into camping, you can stay overnight. Or there is a walking trail. I believe it's over 20 kilometer long walking trails, biking trails. You can bike road bike on the road or have a, a mountain off-road biking trails too. If you like to fishing, you can go to fishing. It's, it's excellent fishing places over there. Also, this has an old house. A uh, old a house name is I not really remember. The Lauder House, if I pronounce right. And this was originally built in 1851, and the family like a generation and the next generation, they lived in that house until the late 1960s. I've been to that one park many years before and what really impressed me, uh, many things, but one of them is really impressed me, for next to the house, just a short distance away, a family cemetery. And I, I don't know why what is the reason I kind of attracted to cemeteries? <laughs> it sounds stupid, I know. I like to walk the cemeteries and, and checking out old graves, looking the name tags on it. I think mosquito is killing me for crows. Shoot. Anyway, at this time we didn't have a time to go to that old house and go to the cemetery. But if you have a chance to go there, you definitely should check out. The cemetery is like a cemetery, it's old. I don't think it's many grave has a, a name tag on it, just the cross where the people buried. Actually, I've been in quite a few countries and more than a few cemeteries. And even in Philippines, I've been two cemeteries, one of them in Manila, other one in Montalban, and it did not take me more than 10 minutes to find the Hungarian name. One of the man even I remember, name was Kovács, an English word blacksmith. So this is, I guess, proves a Hungarian as all over the world. Anyway, get back to the provincial park or national park. They have a electric car charging station, which is I kind of disagree with it. Why they are special, even more than one e-car charging station over there? We were running out, running short of gas, and I have to drive over 45 minutes to find the gas station, and they have two in the park like why they are so special anyway it's just my opinion so uh, the park has a free wi-fi in the visit visitor visitor center they serving food anyway i hope you have a chance you're going to visit it because this is a great place even spent a couple of days not just a couple of hours how we did well, let's and see the second part of the video. Thank you. Once the shuttle has arrived, so we are loaded into this shuttle and riding to the southwest point. Point Pili created during the last ice age. So, in the meantime, we're getting some information from, I guess, is the tour operator. Please note that what to watch and what to be careful. 
swimming or wading into the water is not allowed past the shuttle stop. We hope you enjoy your visit and come back to see us again soon. Apparently he stated this takes about Even 10 minutes. Oh, he's saying in French now. So we arrived to the end, but we need to do some walk. Here is some outlook point, which is not open yet or closed on for some reason. I have no idea why. Well, I would climb up if it's possible. So, this trail is apparently this is a beach trail. There, yeah, on the right. Beach trail. Let's check out the beach trail. Very high, like a apartment building. Sure. Oh, oh. What is here? Okay, let's see. Rocks, big rocks. <laughs> I see no beach here, just on the back. All right. Some photography going on. One, two, three. Smile. One, two, three. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. And, and there is in the back, in the far, is maybe Lemington or Sarnia. I have no idea. And what's supposed to be United States? Well, I'm not sure there's a way to see it from the camera. There are lots of people walking back and forth so we are almost at the end so we are well, actually i am i don't know where is my two companion but i am at almost the most southest point of canada which is just about 100 meters in front of me but there are many peoples i don't think i'm gonna go there Someone might scream, take your f camera away. Oh, there is my companion. So we got to the end when people lining up. And what is up? Most yeah. southern point to Canada, they're waving. You cannot go more south on the land. So you can go more south on the water, but not on the land. So those boats probably heading to the United States. Not sure if there's a way to see them. Whoa! whoa. Shoot! Shoe cleaning, free. <laughs> free shoe cleaning. <laughs> this happens when you not see, not watch where you put your feet. Okay, so right now we face for a nice long walk back. This is still Point Pili, 
So this is the west side of this half island and the name is West Beach. So I'm not sure how uh, easy to see it on the camera, but way back is the people and the people everywhere front of me and I turn around and behind me too is the tables here a, a possibility to make a picnic spend all day if you can't stand the sand however this side of this half island is not protected from the wind so wavy the other side is more quiet so the other side would be better for the beach but the other side the sand is different is all kind of garbage there because it's quiet of wind and the water does not move it away so here we go so you can go to the south air point or swimming all day Whatever you want to do, you can do it here. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoy this video. And please subscribe. Even you did not enjoy it, subscribe. Maybe you will enjoy the next one. Thanks again and see you soon.